Jane King, live at the NASDAQ. Brought to you by Circulus Digital Media, Indiana's locally owned digital media expert. Jane, who did a lot of remote work during the pandemic, starts with that topic this morning. Is it considered easy (laughs) to do from Indiana? Yes, Scott and Drew, it, Wallet Hub actually ranks Indiana right in the middle of states for the ease of remote work, ranks the state 28th. Now, Indiana was high on living environment, while well, Wallet Hub looked at things like internet cost, upload and download speeds, and cybersecurity as well. Well, careers in STEM fields, so those are jobs that emphasize science, technology, engineering, and math, have been some of the fastest growing and best paid jobs in the U.S. for a few decades now, but some of those jobs pay more than others. Now, the high paid STEM majors are in computer and information systems at about $163,000. Some of the lower paid are in environmental science and include forest and conservation technicians. Well, the IRS says the remaining tax refunds could be delayed due to a worker shortage. The head of the agency says continuing fallout from the pandemic and the many tax changes included in the federal relief measures is likely to delay those remaining refunds that still have to go out for this year. And J.P. Morgan says we should be ready for a 40% increase in commodity prices. Now, that size of rally would take commodities like wheat and gas far into record territory. The bank highlighted oil and agricultural products in particular that they're keeping an eye on. And stocks bounced back. We did close higher yesterday. Weekly jobless claims fell to the lowest since 1968. But the worries remain about interest rates. Looks higher today, 50, 60 points up. Life in the NASDAQ market site. I'm Jane King. Back to you, Scott Drew. Jane, this sounds like a fun combo. Lego and Epic Games are planning a metaverse for kids. <laughs> That's right. So these two giants in entertainment and toys, Epic Games, it's a parent company of um, Fortnite, and also Lego are teaming up on a major new project in the metaverse space. Now, it still has to take shape, but the companies say that the venture will be safe for kids and it will be an empowering digital experience. Well, you know, I will say that they already have sort of a leg up because some of the most sort of immersive video games are the Lego games. So a Lego where, up? Yeah, Lego yeah. up. There you go, where you're wielding a Lego lightsaber yeah. or something yeah. like yeah. that. So it, it's not a big, big jump. Yeah. Right. They know each other no, already. No, it kind of makes well. a lot of sense. There you go. I, I think it would probably be pretty popular. We will certainly find out with those two we'll names see. behind it. Very likely. Yep. Jane King in New York.